this puzzle, man. This puzzle. Oh boy. Do you guys remember the rules about portraits? Because we have to make a portrait. We've got this resonator going on. We need to plan out very carefully what you what we're gonna do, uh, or else you'll end up trapped and not being able to finish it. So we have these uh, cut out pieces, those little red dots, are going to cut out something out of the inside of our square. So we pretty much know that uh, the square is going to look like a donut at the end. So we need to make a donut shape. So this is going to take the form in, of, of several different steps. Step number one is we're going to cover this square because we're not going to actually be able to get back over here and do that properly later. Step two is we're going to step over here and get carried over to, to this base from which we'll do the rest of the level. Okay, great. So we need to hit this square, and we need to hit this one, and this one. So now we've got the outside nailed pretty well. Notice that they've already given us the like reverse donut shapes in the, the bottom part. So we're going to end up having to cut, our, uh, cut open the center and walk over those with the black side to, to make them uh, fully black. It'll very nicely line up. Finally, at the end, we're going to have to walk onto the middle with uh, white uh, on that side to uh, unpaint the, the black that's there. And then, at the very end, we need to stand next to the portrait, which means we need to have our black side up with um, the, of course, will be cut at that point. So let's take care of the um, making these guys at the bottom proper. Okay, that's good. So now let's come back here. So we need to get white on. Oops, that was actually I was actually in the right place for that. Uh, this is wrong. So I need to get flipped over here. We're gonna need to paint the opposite side white. Then we need to come back here so that we can step on the black side and then on the white side here. And this is good. Now once we step off here, we should be good.